Okay, so the maritime industry uh, in the Great Lakes generally encompasses the, the five Great Lakes. Uh, it goes everything from tourism, uh, international and domestic. Uh, it can be uh, companies out of Chicago that uh, do autumn cruise trips through the Great Lakes. There's German cruise companies that come through that uh, do the same type of thing that's come through the St. Lawrence Seaway. Uh, but on the industrial side and the, the more maritime that you see it, in the oceans, it's an industry within the Great Lakes that is really focused on minerals uh, and grains and concrete and sand and pretty much anything you can think of that can be shipped uh, via the Great Lakes uh, around the region. And then it also goes internationally. So there's five to six major Great Lakes uh, companies that just sail solely on the Great Lakes. Uh, Great Lakes Fleet, Air Lakes Steamship, uh, all companies that are focused on shipping mainly iron ore, cement, uh, and sand throughout the Great Lakes. Uh, but there's also international companies that come from uh, Holland and Germany and Denmark, and they sail in through the St. Lawrence Seaway, and they do the same type of, thing, same type of uh, shipping. They'll come and pick up raw materials uh, from Duluth and uh, the Chicago area and northern Wisconsin, and they bring it back to Europe. Uh, in their return trip, they're bringing refined steel, uh, and goods to the Great Lakes region uh, as part of the trade system. So uh, it's a it's an industry in the Great Lakes that not many people think of, uh, but it's uh, it is integral to the success of the economies within the Great Lakes region states: uh, Wisconsin, Minnesota, Michigan, Indiana, Ohio, uh, and somewhat Pennsylvania and Western New York. Uh, that keeps their economies going, and it's, it was historically uh, centered on the auto industry, uh, but now it's kind of expanded throughout what they call the Rust Belt within the uh, United States. <laughs>